What's going on guys? Christian from Mad Vapes Lincoln coming at you guys with a quick video on the newest and affordable mech mod that we got in, the Wizmech Mechana. So, cracking into this little bad boy. Missy, you want to tell them a little bit about the design, then I'll get into details with it? Yeah, sure. Um, they actually come in four different colors. Um, you've got your honeycombs, which this is your normal honeycomb, this is your white honeycomb. Um, pretty much resin with like the metal inlay. And then we also have your marbled resin. And the one that I do not have, because we keep selling out of it, is the knurled black. Um, the knurled black is black and it has like that textured grip on it. So that one has been the most popular so far, color wise, anyway. <laughs> now a little bit more in detail in the actual mod. It is a 2700 battery mech mod being also one of the shortest 2700 mechs that are out there right now as you can see like you put your whole fist around and all only my addy's showing now it does come with a sleeve for an 18650 but as we just tried this the voltage drop is insane it honestly makes it seem <laughs> like your battery is completely dead and this is a fully charged 20 uh samsung 25r and it was a rather weak hit now, also, I will show you the bottom of it. The bottom, the actual, it's supposed to just screw right off. But as you can see, it is very trouble, having trouble with it. Do, yeah, it's not even going to come off that way. So, when you're trying to, when you originally get your mechana, you'll notice that, see, to take off the actual button on it was a pain. Due to it having this random O-ring, um, as we came to find out, this O-ring does nothing. It doesn't keep anything in place. It does not hold anything, conduct anything. It's just an O-ring at the edge of it for uh, God only knows why. But if you take that off, and we just screw this bad boy back on. You'll notice that the difference to be able to take it off is ridiculously easy now. Instead of actually trying to force it down all the way with these O-rings, I recommend just taking them off because they do absolutely nothing. Besides that, you can interchange sleeves if you like because the sleeves just pop off themselves. The button in the inside, here we are. This is technically where your conducting happens because as you can see, it's kind of springy. And you'll just see it in here. The spring isn't in the bottom like it normally is. Because as you can see on this one, uh, which one should I just put in? The button just kind of floats in there. There's no magnets or really anything keeping it in place. Your button's actually on top. So when you push it, it makes it fire. But then as you let it go, it springs back down. So that's a pretty cool feature with them. Overall, really nice devices. What do we got these priced at, Misty? $49.99. $49.99 for a really nice mech. I mean, I can't complain with it. I mean, that's a that's a really good hit with the 2700. But in case you guys don't believe me, let me show you how it is with this 18. And if I can just get it to grip right, there it goes. Barely even heating up the coils on that one. And I'm just doing just your standard 0.2 build. Nothing crazy going on here. Um, and with the actual sleeve on that 18, the voltage drop is insane. So definitely recommend sticking to the 2700s. Other than that, guys, they're nice. They're here. We're going to keep getting them in. People keep buying them because, I mean, it's a cheap, nice mech mod. So here at the Mad Vapes of Lincoln, come check them out. Y'all have a great day.